Howdy guys, it's Tachi, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play. The Book of Unwritten Tales. So we've pretty much done everything we can do. Master Brewer, sir! Hello, Master Brewer, sir! Where are you? Master Brewer, sir! Master Brewer! Mm, what? What? We have to tell the other dwarves. There was this gremlin in a cage, and he gave me this ring, and... What kind of ring, then? This, this ring. It's a very important ring. The gremlin said all our fates... Uh, Wilbur, I really don't have time for this kid stuff. I've got more important things to do. But the ring has to be delivered to the Archmage down in the human town. The gremlin said it could end the war. Listen, laddie. That's a ring. What's it supposed to be able to do? It's... I have to. The, the gremlin wasn't lying. Just think about it. When has anybody ever given an important ring to a little being like a gnome? That sort of thing just doesn't happen. Uh, but... Uh... That's enough. Now, go home. It's getting late. <sighs> I guess I can't expect any help from the Master Brewer. I wonder. Oh, you're not going to put it in the fire? I used to be really afraid of that fireplace. Nowadays, I'm only slightly terrified. Let's see what I have in my items. Oh, I have an extendable arm. A perfect fit. Mm. Now we can make long-reaching attacks on bacteria. Oh. Cool. Oh, I know what we can do. Let's go in the kitchen and get rid of that slime. Oh, that's my thing. Now I'm going to do something I should have done a long time ago. It's too bad that slime had to be so evil. Evil slime. Well, we got that. I'd rather not take Nemo Let's apart see. until I know what I'm looking for. Yeah. That won't work. How am I supposed to attach the tarpaulin to the backpack? Hmm. What is that? Oh, that's the, uh... It'll take a long time for the icicle to melt. After all, the pot isn't all that warm. I should speed up the melting process. Alrighty. I'm feeling we're gonna have to grow something, but I'm not really sure. Oh, I want to We gotta go back in the kitchen. The stove. I don't know. I keep thinking about that fire. Let's put that on there. It shouldn't take long to melt the icicle. The stove is still warm. The icicle is gone. All that's left is crystal clear mm. water. Okay. My old gnome scout mm. rucksack. Pretty tough, that. But somehow I always had the feeling it could have been a little larger. A vial of my mum's super fertilizer. Mm. Hmm. I'll thread the rope through the eyes around the edge of the tarpaulin. Done. Parachute? A light, rip-proof tarpaulin. There are eyes along the sides which I have threaded the elven rope through. Let's see. If I pull the rope through the eyes on the rucksack... Yes, that should work. There we go. A parachute. <laughs> My homemade parachute. I really, really hope I'll never need it. Okay. Well, that won't work. It wiggles too much. <laughs> uh... Well, it doesn't like we can do anything. I think I'll let him sleep. He won't help me anyway. 
Yeah, might as well. The X100 makes a pretty good rat hunter. I just hope it never mistakes me for a rat. <laughs> I guess we'll go back in the uh, in the dwarf hole. There's really nothing else we can do. The dwarf hole, the gnome hole. We have a feeling that we have to do something. Hmm. Doesn't look like Mother planted anything in there. So we need some kind of seed or something. Our kitchen. Hmm. There's still some grain in the funnel. Barley, I think. Oh, there we go. I don't even know what to do with one handful of barley. Why do I need two then? Okay. A we good handful of barley from my mother's kitchen. Hmm. I don't even know what to do with one I handful. Can't them. Yes, we can. Let's see if I miss anything in the other rooms. There's nothing there, so and let's head on down go. here again. Still one of the coolest things out there. Let's talk to old Gramps again. Something my granddad is working on. No idea what it is. And I'm pretty certain I don't want to know either. I like my granddad, but his inventions are usually pretty dangerous. Granddad? Call me Colonel. Just hmm. what exactly are we to do now, Colonel Grandad? Colonel. We've just discussed that. You get the equipment, I'll sort out the means of transport. Equipment for what? For equipment. what? For your journey to the town of the humans, of course. You need to pay more attention, my boy. I'm supposed to... I, I thought... Someone else. Who? I very much doubt you'll find anyone else here who's prepared to look death in the eye. This is your chance to be a tragic hero, my boy. A painful loss for the Alliance. Don't you want to be a hero? Sure, I I'd like to do something exciting, but I'm not sure I'm hmm. ready to try being a... Uh... Try? There is no try, only do. This is your chance. You'll be a hero, and I'll show okay. everyone that this old gnome is still good for something. So, here's the plan. You get yourself some good gear, I'll sort out the means of transport. All right. I can have a look around, but no promises. About my equipment. Yes? Mm. Have you got everything? I don't know. What exactly should I take? Let me think. You need a helmet. You can fight without legs, but you can't fight without a head. Without legs. And you need a map of the area. <laughs> Reconnaissance is everything. We are living in the information age. So I need a map and a helmet. Got it. Okay. And then, of course, you need a parachute. Better to be safe than sorry. Um, just... Got the parachute. Why I'm... A parachute? Just a precaution. Uh... I have a parachute. Okay. Fantastic. Parachutes are hard to come by and are difficult to make yourself. After all, you'd only want to entrust your life in a quality product, not something makeshift you've patched together yourself. Trust my life? But, of course. <laughs> I, I mean, I mean, of course not. Of course not. I have the pot. Uh, um, um, I found helmet. The helmet. Excellent soldier. The helmet will protect you from physical attacks. You can even sit on it and use it as a saucepan. Ooh, how practical. Let me see your helmet. It's not all that great, I know, but... Aye. What? It's a good helmet. 
and it's going to protect a good soldier. That is, of course, uh, as long as the enemy doesn't right. attack with dragons, or has wizards in its ranks, or magical swords, and doesn't go for your head. Maybe I should look for some armor with magic. Poppycock! That helmet will do. <laughs> well, we can't expect hmm. any help from the Master Brewer. He doesn't believe the ring is important. I didn't expect much more from that cowardly drunkard. Grandad, he's my boss. Some boss sits in his fortress drinking beer from dawn till dusk while his comrades are fighting on the front line. I think he misses them. Well, perhaps. But one thing's for sure. We are on our own, soldier. Hmm. I'll go look for the rest of my gear. You do that. I've got enough well, to do we, here. I get the map there. But remember, never look a Medusa in the eye. And never look at anyone on the underground. <laughs> right. <laughs> awesome. I wonder if we can fit. It's stuck. Poor thing. Hmm. The flying fish is now firmly clamped into the vise. What can we use? The scissors, maybe? No. I don't want to break it. At least, not without a good reason. Hmm, okay. Maybe the barley? No. Well, let's go back up there. <laughs> we gotta take the bear. Oh, so you can double click as well. And we gotta take that map. The map shows the area between here and the human town of Seastone. We gotta get it. Hmm. Nope. Nope. Hmm. It's worth a try. Yikes! <laughs> What's happening? Oh, nothing much. I just scared off a pixie. What here? At this time of year, <laughs> the beasties are getting more and more cheeky. Phew. That was close. I can't get to the map as long as he's sleeping there. I'll have to distract him somehow. Hmm. No. I know what to do. I think I know what to do. The Master Brewer says it's very easy to... Hmm. I like this music in the background. I really don't know what to do, but... Hmm. I pointed out to the Master Brewer, but then I'd be the one who ends up washing it all up. <laughs> Love our beautiful White Ridge Mountains. It's just a touch quiet around you. So we have the barley. Hmm. Oh. Oh, I don't think it would like that. <laughs> Why not? I thought we'd maybe... Okay. The robot gets its energy from rubbish. Oh, I don't think it would like that. Why not? Can't you say it? Mm hmm. Hmm. I say hmm. Why can't we give it? Can't do 
that either. Maybe we can combine. New. New. Actually, dwarfs have a thing for beautiful architecture. But when it comes to the beer supply, compromises are sometimes made. To be honest, I'm not going to put my hand in there without a very good reason. Who knows what the rat has hidden there? Maybe rotten food, or already digested food, or even more rats. To be honest, <laughs> maybe rot, or even... The X100 is ready for use again. Okay. I just need some new DNA and it's off on the hunt again. Oh, I don't think it would like. Ooh, Master maybe. Brewer, sir. Mm -hmm. Do we get some hair off of him? Um, Mr. Master Brewer, sir, could I maybe borrow that map over there? What, that? Oh, lad, that map shows the finest taverns in the land. And this one's on it, too. Oh, I think I got another one. I don't know what I have to do. I'd be really, really careful with it. No, no, to be quite honest, there hasn't been a lot going on here since war broke out. And I've got no chance of being featured again. That's why the map is staying where it is. I talked to my granddad. He thinks the ring is important too. He wants to help me get to the human town. Yeah, well, of course he wants to do that. Listen to me, laddie. Nothing against your grandpa, but don't you think he's uh, a few gills short of a pint? My granddad is a great soldier and inventor. Yeah, of course he is. Of course he is. But uh, how should I put it? He's maybe had one crash landing too many. His flying machines were mostly a bit to uh, temperamental. And let's face it, he wasn't actually the greatest of pilots. Honestly, son, if your grandpa reckons there's something in that story, then for me, that's just one more reason to keep out of it. Grandad and I will show everyone. I don't want to trouble you any further. Good night. And yourself. Have a good one. Oh, I've got an idea. No, I can't. I... Well, maybe I can. Let's do it. <laughs> I'm gonna burn in hell for this, guaranteed. <laughs> A piece of the Master Brewer's be If he ever finds out, I'm history. <laughs> I wonder no, if I that can't would wait work. to see this. At least it would distract the Master Brewer a bit. Whoa! Ah! Hello! Stop! That wasn't supposed to happen. I have a feeling that wasn't such a brilliant idea. Oh, I love... <laughs> That were amazing! The eternal struggle of dwarf against machine! And I won! <laughs> uh, are you okay? Oh. Of course! And why not? You think a stupid tin bucket's going to beat a proper dwarf? No chance! Ugh, that was good. Something's happening at last. Cause for celebration. I think we should drink to that. Maybe now I can steal the map. I think he's drunk with victory, so he shouldn't see anything. I have it. The map of the area. And that's the last of my gear. I must get back to Grandad. Fast. Alright, so I'm going to end it here. Uh, this is Tachi signing off. Have a good